So today we have two pineapples and we're gonna do a taste test. This one is a $20 pineapple. This one is a $4 pineapple. It's a little bit of a backstory on it. This one we got at the Cleveland West Side Market. It's special and you're gonna see that here in a little bit. And this one I bought at Giant Eagle. Nothing special about it. This one's been genetically modified by Del Monte, right? By Del Monte. And you can't get a top on it because they don't want you to grow it so that you can't reproduce this pineapple. So let's see what we got. Good. Plus we get Normal pineapple, $20 pineapple. That looks good. I think I like the pink better because it's easier to see the core. Uh, maybe I'm just blind. Definitely not a professional pineapple cutter. I'm gonna have my wife mix these up and I'm gonna do a blind taste test. So I'm closing my eyes, you get to mix them up. I know you don't wanna be in the shop, but just a little bit. Let's see if that $20 pineapple is really worth more than the $4 pineapple. Or if it's just cool to look at. Didn't seem very sweet, but it's smooth. All right, I definitely think that second one was a normal pineapple. Can we do it one more time? I think the second one was a normal pineapple. Were those different? Was the second one the normal pineapple? No? I couldn't tell that second time. Hmm. I'd say this one was a little bit smoother, like not as jarring, sour taste wise, but really not much different. So I think it's cool to look at. Taste wise, it's about the same. So not too much to rave about, but still cool to have, and it definitely uh, turned some heads. So. Thanks for watching and uh, just spend the $4 on the regular pineapple. Unless you want something cool. Have a good night, guys.